So you have pelvic floor dysfunction, you need to go see a pelvic floor dysfunction therapist and you're wondering what am I going to be experiencing here? If that's your question, this video is just for you. Hey, this is Dr. Shaki from Core Pelvic Floor Therapy right here in Irvine, Orange County. I know a lot of times people are kind of freaking out when they've got pelvic floor dysfunction issues. And in their mind, pelvic floor dysfunction is incontinence, is pain during sex, maybe um, pain in their pelvis, uh, maybe issues in men, issues with, with ejaculation, things like that. And that's the only time they're thinking of pelvic floor issues. When in reality, pelvic floor dysfunction is a lot more than just that. So then, a lot of times people wonder, well, if I go to a, an office for work to be done to get rid of all these symptoms, do I need to get internal manual exam? And the answer is not necessarily. That is not for every condition, but for a lot of times it allows us to see what else is happening. So just like if you had a shoulder issues, I would be addressing the muscles of your biceps, triceps, the deltoids, your shoulder blades and pecs, etc. It only makes sense to really address the issues. So the muscles inside your pelvis, which is like a bowl, is just as important as the muscles on the outside. They're in fact still part of your musculoskeletal conditions. They are muscles that impact your skeletal system and your movements. So in our office, for example, and every office is different, a lot of times you go into an office and all they do is ask the questions and they go in through the anus or anus and vagina to see what's going on. There is value in that, but that doesn't necessarily have to be the case. So in our office, while what you say is very important and it actually guides us in what direction to go to, what really we focus on is the lifestyle and the things that you, in your mind, don't play that much of a role or any role at all. And in fact, they do play a role. So listening to your story from an expert's point of view is very important and that's what we do in our office. And then not every, like I said, not every examination includes the internal evaluation of your pelvic floor muscles inside your pelvis. But a lot of times, actually every single time, the whole package of lower ab, lower back, lower mid back, your hips and sacroiliac joints are heavily um, evaluated. Your breathing technique is very much evaluated because those are the players and the ones that are missed quite a bit in evaluation of pelvic floor dysfunction. Then not every case requires Kegel exercises. And frankly, let's be real, when it comes to doing Kegel, you can only do Kegel at the muscles very close to your pelvis to the opening of the penis or vagina to the pelvis, not really addressing the whole musculature on the inside. So we happen to have one of the most probably expensive machines that provide 400 Kegels a minute for cases that actually require um, quite a bit of strengthening of the muscles on the inside. That does not include hypertonic or spastic incontinence or pelvic dysfunction for the obvious reasons. Spasm doesn't need contraction, it needs letting go. And then breathing is a huge thing we do on. We can't emphasize enough the importance of breathing in the health of your pelvic floor musculature. So in our office, after the first exam, we know very clearly what it is that you need to do. We spell it out for the patient. We kind of guide you through the path that more than likely you're going to have to take to get to the place that you wish to be. 
that's essentially it. There is nothing else. Evaluation of the posture is very important, which we do with the focus of the practice being postural neurology and neurokinesiology, the movement and functional movement patterns that you need to follow. Those are how we give our patients the tools necessary to really overcome their problem and continue preventing the problem from coming back. So orthopedic and neurological evaluation, musculature evaluation of the, that region is highly important and highly focused on in our exam and treatment. Hope that you find this valuable and thanks for watching.